Mount Rushmore, Crazy Horse Reptile Gardens. It's no secret South Dakotans like to do things big. And that was the case even 70 years ago when Paul Bellamy suggested the Black Hills as a new home for the United Nations. Even though New York ultimately became the permanent location for the UN, today Coda Territory business and political leaders commemorate the history behind the attempts to bring the World Organization to South Dakota. Bellamy's grandson, Marshall Young, spoke at the gathering. I have to disagree with my grandfather, even though he's not here today. I think that the Black Hills is probably a much better place to live now than it would have been with a million population and all the problems that are associated with something of this scale. And we should mention the gathering today was at Reptile Gardens because the UN main building was going to be built right there.